There are numerous factors to consider when selecting a dog, including size, energy level, coat type, and others. However, one of the most important factors in selecting a breed that fits your lifestyle. We'll look at two popular breeds, the XL American Bully and the German Shepherd, both of which are large dogs with very different personalities. It is critical to conduct research before making any decisions. This comprehensive guide compares the XL American Bully Dog to the German Shepherd. We want to make certain that you have all of the information you need to make the best decision for your specific needs and lifestyle. These dogs are well known for their family-friendly personalities and needs. We want to assist you in finding the ideal dog for your home, whether it's a playful pup who enjoys running and playing or a cuddly companion who will be by your side through thick and thin. Let's take a look at the two breeds before we get into our XL Bully versus German Shepherd comparison. The XL Bully is a cross between an American Bully and an XL Pitbull. They are large dogs with ancestors from popular bully breeds like the American Staffordshire Terrier or American Pit Bull Terrier, English Bulldog, and French Bulldog. The German Shepherd, also known as the Alsatian Wolf Dog, is a purebred dog that was developed in Germany in the late 1800s. They were bred as herding dogs at first, but they quickly became known for their loyalty, obedience, and working ability. These two dog breeds are unquestionably excellent options. Now, let's look at some key distinctions to consider before making your final decision. Size. Choosing the right size dog is an important factor in selecting a breed. It will determine how much space you require, how much food they will consume, and even how much exercise they will require. Larger dogs may need more room, but they are more relaxed and laid back. Smaller dogs, on the other hand, may require less exercise and food, but they require more attention and may not be appropriate for families with small children. The XL Bully is a large dog that weighs between 100 and 120 pounds. The German Shepherd, on the other hand, is a medium to large breed that weighs between 50 and 90 pounds. American Bully is available in four different sizes, Pocket Bully, Standard, XL, and XXL. In contrast, the German Shepherd comes in three varieties, American Show Lines, West German Show Lines, and East German Working Lines. Another factor that may influence your decision is the variety of colors and sizes available in each breed. View the various shades of each species below. Blue, Black, Red, White, XL Bully. German Shepherd, Tan Red White. Color may not appear to be important, but it can assist you in selecting a dog that matches your personality and style. Diet and Food. Your companion dog selection may also have an impact on your food budget. Larger dogs, such as the XL Bully, will consume more food than smaller breeds. They may also require a different type of food to maintain their energy levels, such as a high protein diet. Because the German Shepherd is a medium to large breed, they will consume more food than smaller breeds. Their diet, however, is not as specialized as that of the XL Bully, and they can usually get by on a standard dog food diet. The best food for XL Bullies. Because most bullies are food motivated, eating the right foods is critical to keeping them happy and healthy. Here are some of the best XL Bully food options. Chicken, beef, turkey, and lamb are all good sources of protein. Coconut oil, salmon oil. Carbohydrates, sweet potatoes, oatmeal. Carrots, apples, and blueberries are examples of fruits and vegetables. Top German Shepherd food options. German Shepherds are food motivated as well, but their diet is less specialized than that of the XL Bully. They can usually get by on regular dog food, Certain foods, however, are still beneficial to German Shepherds. Protein sources, chicken, beef, and turkey. Coconut oil, salmon oil. Carbohydrates, sweet potatoes, oatmeal. Carrots, apples, and blueberries are examples of fruits and vegetables. 
It is important to note that a dog's diet has a significant impact on its smooth coat, mental stimulation, and future health issues such as hip dysplasia and joint problems. Some health problems are unavoidable, but a healthy diet can help reduce the risk. Temperament These dog breeds have varying temperaments that may or may not suit your lifestyle. The XL Bully is an outgoing and friendly dog breed. They get along well with children and other pets and make excellent guard dogs. The German Shepherd, on the other hand, is a protective and loyal dog breed. They're great for families, but they might be too much for first-time buyers. They are also not suitable for homes with small children or pets. They are brilliant and trainable, but they require consistent and firm training. With early socialization, proper training, and a lot of love, both dogs are companion dog material. Intelligence Before getting a new dog, find out how easy it is to train them. The XL Bully is a smart breed, but they can be stubborn at times. They require consistent and firm training as well as daily exercise, but they are extremely rewarding to train. This new dog breed performs admirably in obedience and agility training. The German Shepherd ranks second out of 138 breeds in intelligence. They are simple to train, but they require a lot of mental stimulation to remain happy and healthy. These powerful dogs do not have inexperienced owners. With the right owner, both the XL Bully and the German Shepherd are excellent family members. Lifespan Another consideration when selecting a new dog is its lifespan. American Bully breeds such as American Bulldogs and Staffordshire Bull Terriers have a lifespan of about 12 years. The German Shepherd has a slightly longer lifespan, lasting approximately 13 years. Several factors may influence the longevity of these dogs, including Size of a dog The majority of dogs with longer lifespans are small to medium breeds. The German Shepherd is a large breed, which could explain why they have a slightly shorter lifespan. While American Bulldogs and Staffordshire Bull Terriers are medium breeds, their lifespan is shorter for dogs their size. Size of the litter the number of puppies in a litter also influences lifespan. Smaller litters produce healthier puppies who live longer. Gender Gender influences lifespan, but not as much as other factors. Male dogs live less than female dogs, but the difference is only about one year. Dogs with lighter bodies may have a slightly longer lifespan. Pedigree The pedigree of a dog is another factor that may influence its lifespan. Dogs with mixed ancestry live longer lives than purebred dogs. This is due to the fact that they are less likely to inherit genetic diseases. The German Shepherd is a purebred dog, whereas American Bullies are a cross between two breeds. It is possible that this is one of the reasons the German Shepherd has a slightly shorter lifespan. Living Situations Cleanliness and nutrition are important for all dogs, but especially for those with a shorter lifespan. To ensure their health, these breeds must be fed a high-quality diet and have regular vet checkups. Both American Bullies and German Shepherds are medium to large breeds that require plenty of exercise. They should be able to run around and play in a yard or park. These breeds can suffer from cold weather, so they should have a warm place to sleep inside. Diet One of the most common health issues that can shorten a dog's life is chronic diarrhea. That is why, for dogs with a shorter lifespan, a high-quality diet is critical. American Bullies and German Shepherds require a high-protein, low-fat diet. They also require a vitamin and mineral-rich diet to support their immune system. These dogs will live longer and healthier lives if they eat a high-quality diet. Infections and Diseases Most dog breeds may have health issues, but some breeds are more susceptible to certain diseases than others. Hip and elbow dysplasia can occur in both American Bullies and German Shepherds. Diseases common in American Bully breeds American Bully breeds such as the XL Bully and Pocket Bully may develop the following health issues. Dysplasia of the hip. Dysplasia of the elbow. Allergies. Skin issues. Heart issues. Cancer. 
Diseases of the liver. German Shepherd diseases that are common. German Shepherds are also prone to the following health issues. Dysplasia of the hips and elbows. Myelopathy with degeneration. Dilatation of the stomach cataracts volvulus exocrine pancreatic insufficiency. Understanding these common health issues will assist you in selecting the best dog for your new family members. Ownership costs. Another important factor to consider when selecting a new dog is the cost of ownership. Because American bullies and German shepherds are medium to large breeds, they will require a lot of food. They will also require regular vet visits and vaccinations. Both American bullies and German shepherds are active breeds that will require plenty of exercise. These breeds have comparable ownership costs, with the exception of the German shepherd, which may be slightly more expensive. Because German Shepherds are purebred dogs, their pedigree influences their price. Pricing for Bully Breeds Standard American Bully between $500 and $2,500 XL American Bully prices range between $1,000 and $3,500. Pocket American Bully prices range between $1,200 and $4,500. German Shepherd Cost Puppies cost $500 to $2,000, while adults cost $1,000 to $3,500. The cost of the dog is not the only expense you will face. You'll also need to budget for food, supplies, vet bills, and training. Purchasing When it comes time to buy your American Bully or German Shepherd, there are a few things to consider. Here are some pointers to help you find the best dog for your family. One conduct research. Before making your final purchase, you should carefully consider the lineage and health of these companion dogs. 2. Think about joining the Kennel Club. If you choose a German Shepherd, make sure the breeder is Kennel Club registered. It guarantees your dog is a purebred German Shepherd. Registration with the Kennel Club is not required for American Bullies, but the United Kennel Club, UKC, does offer registration for these dogs. 3. Select a breeder who provides health guarantees. A reputable breeder will guarantee the health of their puppies. It is an important factor to consider when selecting a breeder. A health guarantee will ensure that your new puppy is healthy and free of genetic defects. How does an American Bully differ from a German Shepherd? The primary distinction between these two breeds is their size. German Shepherds are a large breed, whereas American Bullies are a medium to large breed. Which breed is the most expensive? Because German Shepherds are purebred dogs, their pedigree influences their price. Because American Bullies are not purebred dogs, their pedigree has no bearing on their price. Which breed is more susceptible to health issues? Hip and elbow dysplasia are common in American Bullies and German Shepherds. Degenerative myelopathy and gastric dilatation volvulus are also risks in German Shepherds. Allergies and skin problems are also common in American Bullies. It is critical to consider your lifestyle and needs when deciding between these two breeds. If you want a large breed dog that is protective of your family, the German Shepherd is an excellent choice. The American Bully is an excellent choice if you want a medium to large breed dog that is loving and loyal. Both breeds make excellent companion dogs, so the choice is entirely yours. May this guide assist you in selecting the best furry friend to join your family.